Hey, this is Jimmy Beach with a quick tip video from Alien Skin Software. Exposure's customizable UI allows you to arrange panels to fit your workflow, which helps you to work efficiently. Let's explore the customization options for Exposure's user interface. You can easily show or hide docs, which enables you to view the image you're editing without distraction. The Tab key hides all of Exposure's visible docs. To bring them back, press Tab again. You can also use the gray triangles on the edges of the screen to show or hide individual docs. If a doc is hidden, it will be displayed when you move your cursor near the edge. Now let's talk about Exposure's docs. The right and left docs are divided into upper and lower sections. This means there are four separate quadrants where you can place each of the control panels. If you right-click on a quadrant, Exposure will list a number of options for configuring its contents. The check mark indicates whether a panel is visible. You can toggle panels in each quadrant, off and on, by selecting it in the list. This Show or Hide ability applies to individual quadrants. The options listed below, Show All, Hide All, Expand All, and Collapse All, apply to all the panels in a particular quadrant section. The Solo Mode option ensures that only a single panel is open in a quadrant at a time. This is helpful if you're working on a smaller monitor or if you prefer not to do much scrolling when you work. For more advanced customization options, at the bottom of this menu, you can choose Customize Panels. This opens the Panels tab of Exposure's Preferences dialog. The quadrants in this view represent the four sections of Exposure's right and left docks. You can click on a panel name to toggle between making it visible or hidden from view. If a panel is hidden, its name will have a strike through. Also, you can drag and drop to change the order of any of Exposure's panels. And you can move them between quadrants however you like. If you'd like to go back to the original UI configuration, click the Reset to Defaults button at the bottom of the Panels tab. And that's all we have to cover for this video. Thanks for tuning in. If you haven't used Exposure before, head over to the website and download the free trial.